in the quiet Bavarian town of Waldkirchen, a young Walter Hahn, who the world would come to know as Gunther, sat glued to his television. It was the late 90s, the height of the Monday Night Wars. And amidst the colorful characters and high-flying moves, one figure stood out, Bill Goldberg. Goldberg wasn't the most technically proficient, but there was an undeniable aura about him, a primal intensity that resonated. His entrance, a spectacle of pyro and raw energy, sent shivers, the undefeated streak, the spear, the jackhammer. It was all so simple. Walter, a naturally imposing figure himself, saw in Goldberg a reflection of his own aspirations. He didn't want to be just another wrestler. He wanted to be a force of nature, an unstoppable juggernaut. Goldberg embodied that ideal. He wasn't just a wrestler, he was a phenomenon. As Walter grew older and began his own wrestling journey, Goldberg's influence remained strong. He adopted a similar hard-hitting style, focusing on power and intensity over flashy acrobatics. He cultivated an aura of dominance, a quiet menace that intimidated opponents. When Walter finally stepped onto the grand stage of W, rechristened as Gunther, he carried with him the lessons he'd learned from his childhood hero. He may not have Goldberg's pyrotechnics or iconic entrance music, but the spirit of Goldberg, in every thunderous chop, every bone-rattling powerbomb. And so, when asked who his favorite wrestler was, Gunther didn't hesitate. It was Bill Goldberg, the man who showed him that sometimes the most effective path is the simplest one. The man who taught him that true power comes not just from physical strength, but from an unwavering belief in oneself. Goldberg's influence on Gunther is a testament to the enduring power of inspiration. It shows that even the biggest stars can star as wide-eyed fans, dreaming of following in their hero's footsteps. And sometimes, those dreams can lead to a legacy even greater than the one that inspired them.